the start of the journey, which uh, resulted in the amazing work that took place here in our sanctuary building. Uh, we continued that journey, obviously, in the last several years with a, a revamp of Maxwell Hall and the installation of a new playground. All very exciting stuff and all very expensive stuff. And, uh, and over the years, we have run three capital campaigns here. This church has raised $4.9 million over those 10 years and across those three campaigns. And it is my, my real privilege and exciting honor today to tell you that at the end of April, uh, we sent off our last check to pay off the mortgage. And the memorial is mine. <laughs> Pentecost Sunday, when we remember the flames of the Spirit, what better a day than to take the note which has been marked, paid, and actually burned, right? Um, so we're going to do that here. I tested it on Wednesday. No alarms went off. But if any alarms do go off, the emergency exits are here, here. Okay? I just want to make sure you know that. Um, but it was uh, it was leadership and it was it was vision and it was direction for a church and you came here and you did that and and, uh, and I'm so thankful for what I inherited and um, when I came here the DS that was sending me told me yeah there's it was about a million dollars at the time there's about a million dollars of debt at this church you'll clear that in the campaign I'd never done a campaign in my life and I thought yeah right yeah right. <laughs> But then it came time for our campaign, and, uh, and I got to work a lot more closely with Dustin Cooper from Horizon Stewardship. Dustin has been with this church for all three of those campaigns in those 10 years, and so it would have been wrong to celebrate this moment without him here today. So Dustin, for your uh, consultation, for your leadership, uh, for your pastoral care of this church, and for us as senior pastors, we want to give thanks to you, and we want to honor you, my friend. Uh, I know that we could not have done this without your help as well. Glad to be here. Thank you, we're glad you're here. Chris. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who has made heaven and earth, and we believe that God has led Memorial United Methodist Church to minister to Fernandina Beach, Florida, and to the world. We are, we are committed to this sacred journey. God is with us. He has prospered us to free up debt, to put more resources towards serving others, and strengthening the spiritual lives of the disciples of Jesus Christ. We are committed to this sacred journey. We therefore meet joyfully today to transform indebtedness into humble gratitude and prepare to continue on. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. And now, Holy Father, trusting in your love and goodness, confident in your power and dedicating ourselves anew to the support of your church. And through that support to the growth and expansion of your kingdom, we praise your holy name and we burn this mortgage in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mm -hmm. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's the best kind of Pentecost flavor, right? <laughs> <laughs> Let us pray together. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, we give thanks to you today for the memory of all who faithfully prayed, gave, and worked so that the life in Jesus Christ might continue here from one generation to another. Amen. Amen. Now let us rejoice and be in one accord by enthusiastically and joyfully expressing our commitment to God. We are committed to the journey. Our children 